Welcome, children of God. Welcome to RunAllGodsChildren.com where Jesus is the teacher. He can show you better than we can read. And I say this because we're reading God's word. Who else is better to show us? For he wrote to us so we will know what has happened and what is going to happen. He always told his children what he was about to do. So thank you for coming to RunAllGodsChildren.com where Jesus is the teacher. Oh, Father, the only Father, in the name of thy Son, thy only Son, Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, I pray unto both of you. The children do not believe me. They do not believe that I could call on something so great. They won't even tell people. They keep it in secret. Oh, but you're going to show them that I am the runner for the prize in the holy book to share with them. So why are they so selfish with me? Oh, Father, only Father, I read that you are about to get this word. They don't believe it. I told them about 2024, between now and then, you would have everybody attention because it is written the truth will make them free. They have to go to the truth to stop you. Welcome children of God to RunAllGodsChildren.com where Jesus is the teacher. And I thank you for coming. I'm the runner for the prize in the holy book to share with all God's children. I wrote a letter to you. To all God's children. To see if you can understand really where I'm coming from. And why I called on something so great. I was taught that all my life. I went to God House of Prayer. I went to Sunday school. They say you could call on God anytime. So what makes it so hard for God's children to understand that an old man <laughs> called on somebody so great? But I was young when I called on him. 40 something years ago. Because of this world. Welcome children of God. By coming to run all God's children. We are learning together. About our Lord and Savior. I said to my seal that God is true. By coming to run all God's children, you will know what is written in the holy book. Our Lord God will teach us what he wrote to us by showing us. We are the children of God that was chosen to be his people. His children, we will learn about our Lord God by doing what he delights. 
Remember I read to you what he delights. Learn of him. We know the truth is our Lord and Savior. The true and living word. We know our Lord and Savior has a Father God. I called on Lord God and his Father God. And I received my testimony to share with all God's children. I learned we all run in a race. For the prize in the holy book, St. John, the 8th chapter, the 32nd verse. And you shall know the truth, and the truth shall make you free. We know the truth is our Lord and Savior. He will make us free. I learned we are not a color, a nationality. We are the children of God. And evil, like for God's children, not to know the truth about our Lord God, our Savior. The race is to learn the truth about our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, our Lord God Almighty. I learned that I must endure by receiving my testimony and reading, we all are in the race. I call myself the runner. Read for yourself or let me read God's word and listen. Run and learn with me. Yea, you can be a witness at me showing all God's children when I win the race, that they are children of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. This is the last time the truth will be read. The promise that our Lord God gave to us in his writing, it is written. Jeremiah, the 23rd chapter, the 20th verse. The anger of the Lord shall not return until he execute, and till he have performed the thoughts of his heart. In later days, you shall consider it perfectly. I explain to you why that is written, the thoughts of his heart. I told you he's angry at us. Me too, not just you, but you want to say, no, he ain't angry at me. He's a loving God. He don't like what we've been doing. And I really don't like it because I called him. My friend wanted to know more about the end of time. Our Lord God, as it is written, first, knowledge has to go all over the world. Knowledge. I'll give you a little knowledge. St. John, the third chapter, the 33rd verse. He that have received his testimony have set to his seal that God is true. 
knowledge. St. John, the 16th chapter, the 14th verse. He shall glorify me, for he shall receive of mine, and shall show it unto you. All things that the Father has are mine. Therefore, said I, that he shall take of mine and show it unto you. I've been to many places showing my testimony. Not me, but I'm talking about what was given to me to show you. But who believed? The promise is that our Lord God will send someone. St. John, the 16th chapter, the 7th verse. Nevertheless, I tell you the truth. It is expended for you that I go away. Expended. E X P E D. I N I E N T E X P E D I E N T for you that I go away. For if I go not away, the comforter will not come unto you. But if I depart, I will send him. To you. So that is one promise that the Lord will send someone. Now, children of God, the end of time is coming. When you see what is written, God's word, coming true. Yea, our Lord will make a believer out of us yet. The end of time, Psalms, the 71st chapter, the 18th verse. Now also when I'm old and gray-headed, oh God, forsake me not until I have showed thy power to every one that is to come. I heard, I hear them say, you has to have God. Or, I got God. Please, my Lord, show them you and only Father God has me like them. There's a song written, he got the whole world in his hands, but his children honor him with their mouths and their hearts are far away because why would they say something like what they be talking about? Power. Power is in your word, my Lord. Power is in your word, but who believe our Lord God's word? When I received our Lord God's word 40 or more years ago, I pleaded with the children and showed them the holy book that I received. No one called themselves a child of God. Oh, Lord God, power is in your word, which I received. 
But please don't get mad at me. It's written. So if you get angry, it might be meant for you. The way the children are taught by the doctoring of and percept of man. The way the children are taught by the doctrines and percept of man is the way you are. And you don't even want to admit it. Isaiah, the 29th chapter, 13th verse. Read that. It tell you, read the whole chapter and you will understand more about our God. Their doctrines teach not to fear you, my Lord. I'll say that again. Their doctrine teach not to fear you, my Lord. Our God. The one that brought the children out of Egypt land. Keep coming and I can tell you the things he did for his children. He destroyed an army. And when the children came there, everybody was dead. Our God been taking care of us. Now this is the last time the truth will be read and none of God's children want to learn about God. Or, I'm lying. Because isn't that the reason you go to God's house? To learn about him? Do you know what the Lord hates? Do you know it's six things the Lord hates and the seventh is abomination unto him? Do you know why our Lord says, wrote to us, he's against us? Do you know why he wrote that? He tell you. We must learn what I learned, and that is fear. It is a fearful thing to come into the hands of the Lord. What do you think God is going to do in this last day? What do you think when he came and he told them this parable? That he sent his only son. And they said, oh, this is the heir. Let's kill him. And they did. It is written, what do you think the father is going to do to them people? The way the children are taught is by the doctrine and percept of me. Their doctrine teach not to fear you, my Lord, my God, and only Father God. Please, Psalms, the seventh chapter, the eighth verse. The Lord shall judge the people. Judge me, O oh Lord according to my righteousness and according to my integrity that is in me. So before you children, I ask my Lord to judge me. Judge me, my Lord, and only Father God. I know that I know that the only Father God is belief. 
believe he sent his only begotten son. And faith is our Lord and Savior. For by grace are we saved through faith. Wasn't it kind of our only Father to give us faith? But it had to come because the children are so set in their selfish ways. And I'm not saying that is written. That's the way we are. Romans, the 15th chapter, the fourth verse. Oh, yeah. Who believe our Lord God's word? Romans, the 15th chapter, the fourth verse. For whatsoever things were written aforetime were written for our learning, that through patience and comfort of the scripture might have hope. If you got God, you don't need no hope. And that's what I told my mama. I need him. I don't have him. And I hope he got me because all my life I knew I, I felt he did. That's why I went to him. When I was hurting with my children, my mom and dad, my brothers, people in the street, yeah, I need God. He'll show you. For whatsoever they were written aforetime time was written for our learning. That's what we're doing at runallgodschildren.com, learning. That we, through patience, we're waiting on the Lord. Isn't that what's written also? What are you doing? All I'm doing is waiting on the Lord. Comfort of the scripture you might have hope. And that's who I hope for our Lord and Savior. Children of God, do you think we are learning about our Lord and Savior? Are you learning anything? i tell you what I'm learning. I'm reading it to you. Children of God, what do you think about what we learned so far? And I give you an example. Like, Jesus Christ is the creator of everything. I went and looked it back up. Ephesians, the third chapter, the ninth verse. Do Lord God's children know what hope is? Do we know it is written? Ephesians the fourth chapter, the 13th verse. Till we come in the unity of faith, of the knowledge of the Son of God, unto a perfect man, unto the measure of the stature of the fulfillment of Christ. Until we all come into the unity of faith. Are you a child of God? I asked that before. People get mad. I am a Christian. I know I'm a child of God. Then if you're a child of God, I guess you don't have to be judged neither. Because I heard too. I read two books going to be opened up. 
your name going to be there? What have you done? Have you been nice to anybody? Do you know what righteous is? Coming to run all God's children, we will read knowledge of the holy is understanding. Proverbs, the ninth chapter, the tenth verse. Check that out. It is written, be not children in understanding. How be it? In malice be ye children, but in understanding be men. That's 1 Corinthians, the 14th chapter, the 20th verse. I know wisdom is the fear of the Lord. Also, I know it is written, the Lord gives you wisdom. I pray the Lord give all the children wisdom. Who will not fear our Lord God, the only Father God's Son? If you want to email me, Run with me at runallgodschildren.com. Run with me at runallgodschildren.com. And I don't know if I want to answer anybody. When things start happening, then you, everybody going to come. And I'll read to you further what else is about to happen because our Lord and Savior is coming but things got to get prepared for them. every knee shall bow every tongue shall confess every word come out of your mouth will be that of God and that's written welcome children to runallgodschildren.com where Jesus is the teacher He's all mining. He's the one that wept and prayed for you and me. He's all mining. He's coming back again. He's going to make us free. He's creating everything new for me, me and you. I said he's almighty. He's the God that sits alone. Whoa, he's almighty. Yes, he wept and prayed for you and me. He's almighty. That only be love his son coming back to make us free he's almighty he's our lord god that sits alone he's almighty and he's our only father's son he's almighty I'm not ashamed of his name, Jesus Christ. Lord God Almighty, he's almighty. And I'm going to praise his name until he comes back for his children. He's almighty. Thank you, children, for coming to runallgodschildren.com, where Jesus is the teacher. He is going to show us. But first, the only father, something to think about. Take care of yourself. I hope you don't get us. But if he get you, it's better you than me. <laughs> Bye. Because you stand alone. Remember that. We all stand alone now. You think I'm saying that just be saying that. No, we stay stand alone. Later. <laughs>